Hey, welcome back, everybody. DJ No is here. Thank you so much, our friend. We love it when you're here. We are officially talking fall with the weather starting to turn a little bit cooler. You know what that means. It's time to take a look at our fall colors. What's trending for makeup this autumn? And joining me is Randy Lance, beauty advisor for Merle Norman Cosmetics, and Angie, our model today. It's a great time, fall. It's that time we go we'll start looking forward to what we're going to be wearing. We want to change up our colors. Well, let's talk about that. What is in right now for fall and complementing colors? So this fall is all about complementing yeah. colors, like you said. Um, the biggest question that we get asked in the studio is what colors are going to look best on me? Yeah. And so although there are no real hard fast rules in makeup, you know, you do what feels fun and right to you, um, there are some things that you can do to complement and really, really pop yeah. your own eye color. What's great about our newest palette is, yeah. you know, Merle always does a great job of um, creating palettes that are extremely versatile, but these colors are set up in such a mm. way that they automatically pair together. Oh, good. And like you said, I mean, we want to—we don't want something on us that makes us look worse than we look, R so exactly. we want to help ourselves exactly. out. So, um, what colors do you like with Angie? So today with Angie, we used the gold color here on the palette, kind of in the in the corner. Mm, uh, we used the darker brown on the outside, and then underneath, of course, for uh, Colts Blue, Look we did that. the blue liner so with cute. some of the blue shadow. So it's very pretty. Um, full lips are in, whether you get them, you know, naturally or with your makeup or your lipstick. What yeah. is the secret, though, to making them really have that pop? So we have these amazing plush lip liners, which is what I used on Angie today, and those are eight hour wear. So you're gonna put that mm. on first, but the best way to get that really plump yeah. look is to add some gloss. Now the liner is gonna keep that longevity for your okay. color, but the gloss is actually going to give that real nice pouty plump. So I've got a really pretty one here. This is called Brazen, and applying it mm. kind of to these outer corners and center oh. area. Mm -hmm is going to really give her that nice plumped up look. Because so a lot of times you're thinking, oh, let me just put the gloss everywhere. And you're like, well, yeah. let me just rub also together. put it right there a little so bit. So now she's got that real yeah. pretty kind of a pouty mm. look there mm. on her lips. Those yeah. are gorgeous. Also, this time of year, we may have been a little more tan over the summer. As you start going into winter, it's really tricky with the foundation colors. It is tricky because our skin tones change so much from, mm -hmm. you know, winter to summer and, and vice versa. <laughs> so um, definitely come in and let us check your foundation. Put away the tinted moisturizers. Mm -hmm. Fall is here officially. Yay. Yeah. yeah. Um, and so we're going to get you a little bit more coverage with your foundation, mm -hmm. uh, which is usually what we like to do in the fall. Um, and we'll get you you matched for your perfect color. And maybe pick up a bronzer while you're at yeah. it. I need to get a new bronzer, by the way. We have great bronzers. So I broke yeah. mine. So I'm going to come in and get another one. Us. Yes. All right. For Thank sure. you guys so much. Yeah. You look great. For a closer look at these products, check out one of three Merle Norman locations in central Indiana, Brownsburg, Castleton, Greenwood. I'm in the Brownsburg one all the time. So yeah. I love it there. And, and it's, it's free gift time. time. It's free gift time. Yeah. That's a great time too. And you two uh, Merle Norman products and, and you, you get, get a free, free gift. gift. Yeah. The gifts are awesome. Yes. Okay, 945, Jim O'Brien, what are you doing over there? Oh, you know, Angie, get ready for the weekend and uh, 